Hey, my name is Mani Malarvan and, and uh, I'm going to use this video to present Analytic Kit, a SaaS platform for Web2 and Web3 analytics uh, for business customers to analyze their website and their blockchain data. So this Analytic Kit platform unifies uh, Web2 data and Web3 data and then it collides and provides business intelligence to our customers. Let's go through our tool section one by one in detail. The first tool in the Web2 category is the Traffic Trends. Using this tool, you can analyze the users coming into your website, what they did, how much how much time they spent on your website or your app, D app or any other uh, mobile application. And you can also find out how much time they spent on your website and where they are coming from, uh, which geography they are coming from and how frequently they are visiting. All this information you can able to identify using the graph we provided. And we have a dashboard. You can able to create uh, whatever information, whatever metrics you are calculating. You can able to create a dashboard and start creating your graphs. Once the data started collecting, the analytic kit platform will automatically generate those graphs for you. And then in the second tool, we have funnel. It's basically you have a marketing or a sales funnel you set up for your website or for your application. Uh, you can able to see how many users came into the first step, how many users came to the second step, and then third step, so on and so forth. Say in a typical e-commerce website, uh, if you have a website and where you can sell various uh, NFT tokens, then you can able to identify how many users came into your website and how many users uh, purchased a NFT token or how many users bought the buy, click the buy button. You can collect all the information using this uh, funnel tool and also later on we can explain uh, what exactly they bought in Web3 uh, in Ethereum platform, whether how many tokens they bought and what exactly they did after visiting your website. So you can able to identify those using the funnel tool. In the loyalty lens tool, basically you can able to understand how frequent your customers are coming to your website and what activities they are doing on your website. So using this tool, you can able to see uh, if you have a marketing campaign, how efficiently the marketing campaign has been run and uh, who are all the users they are frequently visiting or what activities they are doing on your website. And then the other tool we have is a trial. It's basically, it shows the user navigation path on your website. Say they logged into your website and then they are going to the product page or a subscription page. You can able to see all the flow uh, for each particular user coming into their website and those informations will be stored in our Analytic SaaS platform and uh, using our UI tools, uh, you can able to view the graphs uh, for your customers visitors customers and visitors and then segmenter in this tool uh, you collected all the data uh, the users coming in and then the funnel data all the informations now you want to go into the deeper analysis okay you want to see I want to group all the users coming from a particular geography you can able to do it or if you want to group all the users using a mobile application versus website you can collect all those informations and group and then you can run performance deeper performance analysis on a particular uh, set of users uh, it's basically creating code uh, for your users uh, population and trying to run various data analysis um, for your users and then in the growth monitor tool, uh, you can see um, how the entire uh, website or your uh, D app platform is doing on the growth wise. Uh, you can able to see how many users came in in the beginning and uh, how many users are currently engaging, whether your website is growing in numbers or it's declining or within a month, it, whether which part of the days it, it has happened. Up, uh, up users visit versus a lower users visit. All the information uh, you can able to see it using the growth monitor. In the loyalty metrics uh, tool, 
uh, in the loyalty lens uh, we explained about uh, what activities your frequent visitors are doing your regular customers are doing in the loyalty metrics uh, you can able to create metrics uh, various metrics for yourself uh, and identify how well that metrics are performing uh, on your loyalty uh, loyal customers the frequent customers the recorder tool is basically a playback tool uh, any user coming into your website whether the registered user or a new user uh, visiting your website uh, they do various activities on your website or your uh, digital uh, application on the mobile phone you can able to capture each and every mouse click uh, on the from the website or from the D apps and you can able to go through a playback using this tool uh, you can identify if they are having issues and how much time they are spending on each page and what exactly they are doing you can able to identify all those using this recorder tool and then uh, the, our final tool uh, in the web 2 category is in the integration hub in integration hub uh, you can able to identify if you want to integrate multiple applications external applications using this annual ticket you can do so using this integration hub say for example any time uh, you want to your new user is created or new user is registered you want to send an email to your slack or you want to send an email to gmail or you want to send a message to slack you can do so using the integration hub platform so um, we have uh, existing we have support for multiple different tools but in the future uh, we are working on creating new applications uh, say for example if you want to send all your uh, data to Zapier tool you can do so by just writing a Zapier app and then integrating using this integration hub tool so those are all the tools uh, we have available for web2 the so far whatever the tools i explained that comes on the web2 category uh, using that you can able to capture the website again all the tools uh, in the web2 category is similar to google analytics or amplitude or max panel any of the existing products you are familiar with it is similar to that so the innovation happened in the web3 category in the web3 tools uh, we have a chain campaign and wallet analytic let's go through each one of them in the chain campaign it's very, for example for the your nft airdrop you want to create a marketing campaign you can create a marketing campaign using our uh, uh, chain campaign tool and you can say a start date of january 1st to january 31st say you have a tool you can see how many users they logged in how many users uh, they visited using the web 2 tools and then if once they log in how many nfts they bought or if we are selling any other tokens uh, how many they bought and what exactly they did uh, with their nfts all the informations with, which are stored in ethereum transactions token transactions logs and everything so we collect every day night on a regular and daily basis and we store it and using various graphical analysis you can able to see so you can collate uh, how what how exactly your marketing campaign is performing on one end and also you can see the final result uh, what are all the nfts they bought so all those informations you can able to collate and that gives you an idea how well your marketing campaign is uh, working um, for you or if you are uh, managing other customers you can able to use that as well in the wallet analytical tool uh, anytime a user logs into your website then if they have a, a, a public uh, address blockchain address in their wallet then whenever they log in into their wallet we capture that data and we store it in our database again all those informations uh, we are capturing only if the user authorizes we, we are not capturing without user knowledge so all the security and everything is in place our entire infrastructure is running on the cloud architecture in AWS so everything is safely secure if any time if you or your user don't want to store the data it's uh, you can easily delete the data from our uh, backend systems
so in the wallet analytic uh, once we capture the uh, wallet address uh, so we use that and we go to ethereum blockchain collect all the transactions and token transfers and store it in the database so that using that you can see uh, what are all the tokens nft tokens they have including your own token or your competitors tokens and how they interacted with your contract uh, the public address so you collect all the information uh, uh, we collect all the information and store it in our database and again we have various graphic uh, elements for you to view those informations so those are all the pretty much the tools that uh, we offer right now um, at present uh, we are uh, offering only ethereum transactions uh, business intelligence but in the near future future uh, we are planning to incorporate uh, multiple other uh, blockchain networks so right now uh, I introduced the analytic gate in the next video I'm going to show you how the how to create an account how to set up uh, a JavaScript on your website and how to collect the data and how what exactly you need to do to capture the data and view the graphics in more detail thank you bye